Here in Chicago, I randomly select one block in the south side of Chicago. And it's here that I find not only one, but four Korean-owned beauty supply stores on the same block, all within 100 feet of each other. Look at this. Uh, this shows how this store is 33 years old, part of the history. But uh, I have to replace with the, some of these pairs. Excuse me, girls. What town am I in? You're in Chicago. Chicago. Yeah. yeah, Chicago. And let's see your hairdo. Let's see it. Whoa, turn around. Who did that? My mom. Wow. Now, um, I see a, a beauty supply store right across the street. Yeah. Is that black owned or Korean owned? That's, I think that's uh, Korean, Korean owned. owned. Korean Sorry? Korean, Korean owned. owned. What do you think about the Koreans owning all the black beauty supply stores? Well, it's very not good because I think the black people should be able to own some things. Yeah. And just not all Koreans should be able to own. But I think because why they're not doing it is because discouragement and black, most black folks, they're really uh, just like going to jail now because other people are convincing them to do other different things like crimes and different stuff like that. So that's why. How many black owned beauty supply stores are there in Chicago that you know of? I don't. How long have you been in the business? Like uh, 14 years ago. Yeah, 14. No. Just like a, something like this. How many black owned beauty supply stores are there in Chicago? How many? Yeah, black owned. I think so, over 10. Yeah. A lot of, you know, more. 10 stores. Oh, over 10, I think, yeah. yeah. And how many Korean owned? Koreans, uh, so almost 80, 80 percent. Uh, maybe I think 300. Some 300, some you know, different store.